back. You know it's the holidays, and what better way to celebrate than by using a Western New York staple in your Thanksgiving recipes. Joining me now in the daytime Buffalo studio is Mike Eckert of Salins. Hello, Mike. Hi, how are nice you? Nice to see you. Thank you for joining yeah, us today right before Thanksgiving. Us. So we have some great recipes here, some great products. Let's explain what you brought in today. Absolutely. So today we're going to focus on our smokehouse cocktail wiener. So it's the holidays. Um, everybody's looking for those different appetizers and easy meals to prep, right? Thursday morning, you're going to be in the kitchen for, you know, so many hours. Sure. We've made it simple. So everybody does, you know, you've seen the bacon wrap cocktail wieners or the uh, pigs in a blanket, as you mentioned mm -hmm. earlier. Mm -hmm. We've got a couple recipes that are literally two and three ingredients. So we'll start off with our buffalo style. Okay. Uh, we like to use, uh, you know, a little uh, half can of beer in here. You've got your favorite Western New York hot sauce. Of I know course. there's a lot out there. Mm -hmm. um, and throw these right into the crock pot. It's simple, it's easy. Um, and a can of uh, condensed um, chicken soup and um, cream of chicken soup and let it sit for two, three hours, you're good to go. Um, I was making them this morning, so again, real easy. This is our sweet and uh, slow smoky, so kind of your chili sauce and your grape jelly. Again, two, three ingredients, set it in there and forget it. Make your holidays simple. So this is a, what is this? Little a chili, chili sauce little chili with sauce. actual jelly. Yeah. I would yeah. never think to pair these together in yeah. a crock pot, you, you said? You put it right in the crock pot okay. or slow cooker. Again, throw it over low heat for four to five hours or put it up on high if you got company coming in, uh, you know, unexpectedly. Sure. Um, but yeah, everything's ready ready to go. So it's a, it's a fantastic, quick, easy meal, appetizer, uh, around the holidays, Thanksgiving, Christmas coming up, so. And then for yeah. me, you have the celery and the blue cheese. I've got, we brought the, the, the celery here. and the blue cheese option. <laughs> yes, you can still put some hot sauce sure, on that. You can sure. have that, yeah, so. <laughs> Pretend like it's a hot dog, right? <laughs> exactly. Right. But again, these cocktail wieners for us, it's, um, you know, it was just about making that quality hot dog that everybody's used to at Ted's or Louie's and things like that, just making it in a bite-sized package. And these are great options for even like little appetizers and snacks, right? Abs when you're absolutely. kind of waiting for Thanksgiving dinner to be done absolutely this is perfect for like a kid's menu too or you know just a kid's snack again chicken fingers and things like that why not serve them up some hot dogs they're skinless so it's perfect for those young ones that you know you gotta every parent knows you gotta peel the skin off the salmon hot dogs for the kids because they don't like that but again it's just a great uh, a great alternative quick easy meal you know they're gluten-free so again no bun no mess no option you know things like that so and for the parents would you put or that that pigs in a blanket can you explain that for you know kids who like the the mini hot dogs. Yeah, absolutely. So we, uh, we've got some recipes on our website, salen.com. Um, so you can go on there, but yeah, just take the, um, you know, the pigs in the blanket, you wrap them in, um, I'm losing the word right now, but you wrap them up in the little rolls. Yeah, pastry, yeah, <laughs> pastry, pastry rolls. Yeah, pastry rolls and you bake them and then you can dip them in your hot sauces or your barbecue sauces, ketchup and mustard, things like that. Very so nice. yeah, just Very some nice. fun options for the holidays. Where is Salins located? And all grocery stores, where can we, we you can, uh, purchase Salins? You, you can find these in all local grocery stores, absolutely. So we're, uh, again, we, we're expanding with these and these are a new item for us. So we just wanted to, to share some different recipes and things that we have for the holidays. And one quick question back yeah. to these. Uh, Buffalo these style. But the Buffalo style, yeah. any beer works? Any, uh, any style? Any beer, you can go non-alcoholic. Again, your favorite, uh, you know, your favorite beer of choice. We don't, uh, you know, we didn't specialize. That's why we've got an Akuzi this morning. Sure. So any we don't beer want, of your choice. We don't want yeah, <laughs> any sure. beer of your choice, okay, non-alcoholic nice. as well. So yeah. Let's talk about Salins. You guys do so much in the community. There's so much going on with Salins. We What's do. ahead of you, ahead for you guys? So for us, we're a 154 year old family run business, fifth generation, right? So that, that to us is very important and we've been in Buffalo all that, that whole time. So for us, it's about giving back, getting into the community um, in different organizations in different ways, whether that's donating products, whether that's donating dollars and, or donating employees' times and things like that. So we're spread out there. Um, we, we, we um, you know, a lot of meat raffles come to us, a lot of fundraisers and things like that. So we like to be a part of it when we can, where we can. And why is it so important to give back, especially thinking about Thanksgiving, giving back? You guys are a very charitable um, company, why is it so important for you guys personally? I think again for us it goes back to that Western New York Buffalo staple. So we have so many customers out there and fans of Salins in Buffalo and then across the country that have supported us over those 150 years. So for us it's, it's nice to give back. Um, to the community that's supported us over so so many years. Wonderful. So let's yeah. just remind people really yeah. quickly. So if you want the buffalo style, you're putting this in the crock pot for how long? Crock pot on high for about two or three hours. Um, the sweet and slow smokers over here, again, low 
four or five hours, you can put that on high for about two or three hours again. All the recipes are on salem.com and we've got some other ones like the pigs in a blanket, bacon wrap cocktail wieners and things like that. So everything's on the website. Now the biggest question I have for you is are you going to be incorporating this product into your Thanksgiving meal? Yeah, absolutely. Of I have course, to, right? right? Yeah, I work for <laughs> Salem, so we gotta bring these home. So the family always loves coming into town and uh, and enjoying some great Salem's products when they're there. So all right, wonderful. Anything else you want to add about Salem's and what you're doing here? It's uh, again just uh, we hope we can be around those holiday tables with the, your families. So uh, just happy Thanksgiving, everybody, and enjoy uh, enjoy the holidays with family and friends and Salem's. All right, thank you, Mike, for being Thanks, here today. Cool. Happy it. Thanksgiving. I will uh, partake in some celery, celery and blue, and blue cheese, cheese for the vegetarians <laughs> out there. But if you'd like to learn more about their holiday recipe ideas, just head over to their website at Salem.com.